This is Young Trader, and this is Midday Trading. Today we're going to take a look here at the New Zealand dollar uh, versus the U.S. dollar. This video is for information purposes only. Not a recommendation to buy, sell the stock, my DTF. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. All right, here we have the uh, U.S. dollar on a daily chart, and we have the no New Zealand dollar here on the uh, weekly chart. Okay, so we got them side by side. So you can see how the U.S. dollar here, it bottomed right here at 99.57, and it just screamed right on up, okay? Now, if you look at this, though, what do we have here, okay? So you had 107.34, and then we put in a 107.11, okay? So you put in a double top right there, and it sold right on down, all the way down here to the 102 level, okay? So let's just see what kind of support that was in. So when you take this going all the way across here, you're basically here right in the thick of here of all your uh, uh, levels here, okay? So what it is here now is we have to look at the downside. So what you want to do is you want to look at this 200 SMA here on the dollar. So you look want to look at 103.59. Okay, if that is lost here, then we look to this 8 SMA here. That's 103.30. And then we look here to like today's low which is 103.06. Then we come over to the top of this candle here. Um, we're looking at uh, uh, 103. And then we look to the bottom of this candle here. You're looking at um, 102.71. And then your big retest down here is 102.46. Now, on your upside here, we have to look at today's high. So you're looking at 103.85 here. And then we got to compare that to this level right here, 103.84. So you can see if you take the line right across here, Okay, so you went, ran right into resistance. Now, if you can get above that, then we come over to this candle right here. You're looking at 103.97 here. And then we look at 104.22. That is your 21 SMA here, okay? Again, above that, then we look here at your 100-day, 104.29. Then what we do is we go always to the next stage. So you're looking at here at uh, 104.55 here. Then we look to the bottom of this candle here. You're looking at 104.85. Uh, uh, and then we come all the way up here to your retest here of your 50-day at 105.45. But you got a lot of resistance here with the 21, the 100-day, to see if you can get back into this level here and a possible retest here of 106.22 uh, uh, coming right across here, okay? So if you can get above that, then we can have a retest here and there. But you had a really nice double top here. So if you're trading the dollar here, that was a really, really nice short. You can see how you had a bear flag here and then all the way down, bear flag down, and then all the way down here to the low. Now it's trying to rally here. So the key today is it needs to hold this 200-day. Okay, so you're sitting right there at 103.59 here. If that's lost, your big target is 103.30 and then 102.46. Now, you look on here under New Zealand. Well, this is doing opposite. Actually, you know, this pretty much the opposite. Now, this is a weekly chart here. Okay, so on the downside, you want to watch this 50-day at 0.61. If that is lost here, then you come right down here to this 2 point, uh, I mean, uh, point, uh, five, nine here. That is going to be your 8-day and your 21-day. And then if that's lost, we come to this candle here. Okay, you're looking at um, uh, 0.58, and then we have... 0.57 here, which is your big retest area, okay? So bottom line, when this sold off here, it never did retest this, this big low here. It just came down here really nice here, here, and then it's starting to rally up here. Now, but if you look at this here, you can see here, you double topped here, it sold down, try to go high, and then now we're over here. So you have a series of lower highs, and that's never good on the chart, okay? So on the upside here, you want to watch this 100-day. This is going to be very crucial, 0.62. And then we come up to 0.63. And then we want to come up to this candle right here, which is basically 0.64. If you can get above, this is your target, 0.65, which lines up very, very nicely uh, right here with this 0.65 going right across. So that is going to be very, very strong resistance. But right now, you've got a series of lower highs that is never good. And then over here, you got a series of lower lows. So we got to see how this shakes out here. But the key is going to be that uh, 100 estimate at 0.62. Then you can just work 0 0.63, 0 0.64. And the big boy is going to be that 0 0.65. If you can get above that 0 0.65, then we can rally, rally and watch the candles here 
all the way up to 0 0.70. However, you know, this pattern right here is usually a very bearish pattern here. So we got to see how that shakes out. So when you compare that to the dollar here, you look at this right here, okay? See, you look at this MACD. Now, this is curling up here very, very nicely. If that green gets above that red here, your RSI here is curling up here. If that gets right about above there, you could push this right back up here again here, at least here to this area here, if not to the 105 area here very easily, which would take this New Zealand dollar right back and down here and a possible retest here of the 0.57. All right, that's what I got for you today. Thanks for watching.